Direction for Loki Shielding Diaspora. Let's go. And I think the first part in the song of Children Diaspora is uh, when it's in the city of fog because you are, uh, you are if you uh, I say if you don't know uh, because people uh, sorry I forget it. The, the, the song is about I think the part of first song is about slave uh, slave trade like uh, Captain Coke is uh, when they take uh, yeah sorry so he say something like in the if you lost in the fog uh, the sun is never shining that do not mean it, when if, if people not see you and hear about you who you are don't mean you are not existing and so on and uh, yeah sense of dislocation type of pain that could not be contained in a dissertation yes. the reason that the terrified are setting fires yes. the reason they couldn't jeopardize Zephaniah considered as a compliment if the beauty is fetishized your history is power that's the reason some are petrified colonial mimic mask were crying behind the mask Col- colonial yeah exactly here he say a uh, co- colonial man mask behind their mask uh, the mask and that is true, like uh, when I was in the last video about in their England, like the colonial powers, uh, they uh, try to hide the crime they have made against other people. And uh, that would mean that if, um, like lots of people was, was taking a slave to other countries, uh, and then they, after the slave gets free, lots of them, find no work or find anything place to live and all the criminals was was the slave traders uh change who they are in the behind the mask uh for they yeah they, they think that this never happened and um, this is how i see the song is how i think what he's what he say is that he say um they uh, try to uh, brush it under the carpet, and this never happened. But yeah, so I can be I can be wrong, and let's continue. Or a man with amnesia trying to find his past. Anthony Walker never had a weapon, but he still got him. Stephen Lawrence. Oh, okay, okay. So he he he. The first part uh, in the song is about uh, uh, colonial power and slave trade, and the other one the other part right now is about. The police violence in uh, England and America, and so on. Like uh, when people police uh, police shooting shoot people uh, with no uh, with no reason, and uh, and so on. Uh, yeah. So because there are different color, different uh, in, this, in a different culture, and so on. Yeah. Okay, so he, he uh, so he talked about different famous people some are from different cultures. Like uh, he's, I don't know who the, the, some of them are, but I think they are famous. When he and he speak about them, they are uh, people like from diaspora, and diaspora is um, means people. Uh, 
so are forced from their uh, countries in different way and they still want to go back to their country and they where they are they feel they, they feel they are lost in the country they are forced into like uh, like one example the Jews in the Babylonia and so on yeah so and black slaves in Eng- England like in Caribbean or uh, in Brazil and uh, and so, on. so that that's why I say um, in the beginning, a man with amnesia tried to find his past, and what he means with that, a person with amnesia is a person who always forget forget because of the yeah of this because of the amnesia, and that's a very interesting thing when he say in the song. I really like that part when he say. I think what he, I think now what he mean. Uh, when when people f- have forgot who they were, they have have forgot their culture and they have forgot where they come from, and they are like they are just in uh, the system of like English Empire or in uh, as America, and they have forgot who their roots, or how, what language they speak, what uh, music, what history, and uh, that's it, what I think what he mean. A man with amnesia f- trying to find his past is a person, a, a person, someone trying to find who they were before the, they was taken on the sh- in the, uh, in the ship, on the ship to in, uh, to a place, and they try to find who they really where they come from and their culture, if they are assimilated and and, and so on. Yeah, I can be wrong. And somebody can leave a comment in the comment section uh, what they think, what they mean with the man with amnesia in the song The Children of Diaspora, and so on. Yeah, let's continue. Say a thing here now is um, if you bleach your skin and you privilege seeking in, and that is a hint to what is happening like in the, in in Brazil or in uh, South Korea, is many people use def- different creams like to make themselves their skin uh, may more whiter and lots of things in the place with. Uh, um, Oh, when you have lighter skin, you get easier work, so lo- and you operate your eyes, you look more western. So that's what he means. Also, if you, uh, that is a very interesting thing. He say, if you bleach your skin, previously sinking in. And so, and that is totally true. If you're more white, in the uh, in the system, you get easier work, you get more money. A lot of culture use that as the cream or. Uh, operations where they want to look more white like one example is um, is Michael Jackson Michael Jackson uh, f- paint he used cream to make his skin more whiter f- f- the more whiter you are that's the more more the system uh, give you more better work and accept you more it's a very strange thing um, the, there's only a thing I understand, but I only know in uh, in Brazil. The Brazil is very special for this thing. Is for when people are more have white whiter skin, like in, especially in the uh, in the movie industry. So that's what I mean. If you used to, if you're more white, you get better uh, privilege, uh, and so on. Yeah. So that is why this is uh, a privileged thing. That is totally true. What he say in this part. Yeah. Let's go. Are we 
missing a link. The Asper is the reason MJ did to his nose what they did to the Sphinx. Yeah, exactly. That is second what I said before with Michael Jackson is the reason why he, uh, he uh, uh, the second word that I mean with this um, pri- why privilege thinking with the, is because the, yeah exactly what I said with Michael Jackson and other thing why he's later say, after that he say about talk about the swings and um, yeah this is very interesting also is um, many yeah I, it's a really hard thing now. But many f- other people think uh, that some European col- colonial colonials they do a different things to the uh, in the, to the Sphinx, uh, for they want to make the Sphinx more you look more westernized, and that is um, a very what can I say very interesting thing. For, uh, but really about like many people when they speak about e- e- Egyptian people like from Egypt uh, and but where they really come from like if there was if there was black or there was more brown people but it's, that is very I think I can uh, just say I think is um, Egypt uh, was a mixed with different culture like uh, the, uh, the Hittites uh, the, the Assyrians, the Greeks, the Persians, uh, the the Turks, like uh, like the Ma- uh, Mamluks, and uh, later the Ottomans, and then the F- French. Uh, so this very interesting thing also really about uh, and the Ethiopians. Uh, uh, um, so who the, who was really was the Egyptians? Who was really they come from? Uh, I I have no idea. But this is totally impossible for me uh, to say if the Egyptian was black or brown. Maybe there was a mix of the two of them, or other thing that is totally impossible. And I think when people say. At, the Egyptians was only black. That I think is totally stupid. For a, co- a co- of Egyptian think we have think I think have a lot of different people in the empire, so a different col- uh, color and different uh, 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 cultures and density. Um, so that yeah, that f- is the only thing. Is. Um, it's for me, is a big uh, question. Is uh, is is that uh, other thing? Also, I can say is, is do they really do they really matter if the Egyptian were brown or black or white? Is that really important for some? Maybe for some people, it's important. For me, I don't really care. But I think this is more interesting culture in the world than the Egyptians, and so I, I really question. I think it's impossible to know who the Egyptians were. For I think there was so big empire, there was so much different culture people from in the empire, and lots of the people. So I think if you if you go back in time, if you go around in the in city of uh, Tief or in Memphis. Uh, around 300 or BC or and so on. If you go around in the city, I think you can see many different colors of people and in the city. Like, so I, yeah. So I don't think uh, I don't think they really matter what kind of skin color you have if you are uh, Egyptian. I think that is a bit um, strange thing and and so on. Yeah. So and the other thing is also is. Um, when um, when you okay okay I also think I I I also understand what he mean with the swings nose, for when the uh, the sculpture a, a black person as in sculpture they always use the nose in build a special way like um, an example like if you uh, if you do comparison with. Uh, Buddha sculpture in Afghanistan and Buddha sculpture in uh, in Japan or in uh, Korea is uh, totally different f- shape of the nose 
in the sculpture because the different culture use a special way how they sculpturing a statue and uh, yeah so <laughs> is uh, I think the Kushan was a very very nice interesting empire in history like the Kushan Empire uh, but I but I don't think um, I don't think that's important to uh, talk about skin colors when you talk about a big empire like Egypt or Roman Empire. So that is so hard to say. Oh, he, this this was they were black or oh they have to be. They are, of course they was black. They are people say that is racist. Of course not. Of course some of the Egyptian pharaohs were black. Some of them were more brown. Some of them were more as uh, from Asia, like uh, the Assyrians later, and so on. So yeah, um, yeah. Let's continue on. Why Marley made the most classic of art? The reason Gabby Douglas didn't put a hand on her heart. The simplest way, but what I say, but mean with the scene on diaspora, is about different people, like from different culture, famous people, like Michael Jackson, Bob Marley. And lots of them, like uh, my great, uh, one of them is other, the, the art. I think he speaks about the, the Bob Marley artist that who paint all the covers, and but all of them was treating dif- treated differently of the system because who they were. But they, yeah. So that I think what he mean with the Shin diaspora means people, some like are yeah normal people and famous people. Some are because of they are the skin color or where they come from, they are treated differently, and what a white person and so on should, yeah. The reason Malcolm Little changed his name to X, the reason the president's melanin remains a threat. I had made a clock, they arrested and mangled his name, but the root of the word is to thank and to praise. Racism manifests in many cancerous ways. And that also, that also, very thing, that thing, also very special thing is um, when he say. Racism is manifesting in many different cancerous way. If that is totally true. Racism is a big, big discussion about racism, about different cult, different system they use, and uh, racism can be so special, special thing like um, your name. If you have a special name, you may get you never maybe get really hard to get to work. Uh, to get where you have that name or other th- other thing can be just because you have um, a turban if you are Sikh you maybe cannot work I- as a in a uh, bus station or as a police in, in the and so on. because so many f- many that is very a very complex thing is um, the system racism uh, the system racism can, racism can be very diverse in special ways some racism can be very direct like uh, they are use violence against different skin colors and other system of racism can be they use they build in the system uh, so this person can, maybe cannot get that good education because they they use that system and um, yeah, this is a very very complicated thing, and if I if I really go go deep in that system about the racism and system and speak about that, is yeah then I they're gonna take too long time to speak about all the racism and systems in the world and how it's gonna be too complicated and yeah so. Maybe I have to look it up more, more and uh, so that is too uh, deep. The only thing I can say, I re- I agreed with everything he say in the album, and I, but uh, I really agreed, I agreed with all the things, and yeah. So let's continue with the song. We must rally for change in these most tragic of days, cause Emmett Till never had a weapon, but they still got him. Tommy Rice never had a weapon, but they still shot him. Boone Sterling never had a weapon, but they still shot him. They call him First World Diaspora Problems. So you wonder what became of the children of Diaspora, those that innovated in their ways and their vernacular, those that saw their traces in the faces of the massacred. I wonder what became of them, tell me what became of them. Nina Simone was a child of Diaspora. 
uh, also here they also the same thing when he speak about um, uh, like when like uh, the, yeah so I, I now I understand. so he, when he said the uh, children diaspora he means people with different culture like uh, no matter what, what culture with different culture like in uh, Caribbean uh, Brazil uh, Morocco he means people from different countries and so, some of them w- was famous people like Bob Marley, Michael Jackson, Nina Simone and he he also say about that is they people should not be f- afraid because they were famous and they were that kind of people that country these people so what shot of the police was from but so I also mean like um, if you are a famous person you get a special ticket for a special thing but if you're a normal person from that country uh, and you and you are poor uh, you are you almost all of your right is gone because yeah because of the system uh, the syst- yeah the system is is very unfair and no system in the world is fair uh, because the system always gonna make a rich person more rich in the end and a really poor person more poor for the system build that way and uh, yeah so that is um, oh, how can I say it it's so um, that also you say in, in the album you also say uh, in the song uh, racism is uh, uh, in a many cancerous way and that the oxidat is racism make uh, a system that when like one example when a lot of the people from Caribbean come to England and they get lesser uh, good work they really get bad work but they they study all of their lives in the English way in English cult culture and English language and so, but the only reason they were treated differently were because of the skin color and that is why that I nowadays what I really think what he mean he means uh, the system is racist racist against people for the system is make that make that way and yeah so let us uh, f- finish this song yeah They also say uh, they're never gonna bow f- for the queen, and then, then they speak with the English Empire, and they they don't want to feel fall in the system, and yeah, um, there was maybe a lot of things I say in this reaction, so it's maybe not correct, and uh, go on. Man, this was this was my reaction for the song uh, "Children of Diaspora," and I try my really my best for this reaction uh, to say that uh, some of the uh, something in the video uh, was really complicated to talk about and really uh, give it um, uh, yeah give it um, fine. So yeah, so. Tell me what you think the, the song is about and leave it in the comments and uh, yeah this was my reaction for Children of Diaspora and yeah let's finish it.
to the queen, Lord. Never bow to the queen, no. Never bow, never bow to the queen, Lord. This was my reaction, and that was all.